it's annoying that I keep going back and forth from my phone to my iPad or my laptop. I mean my camera. It is a little annoying. I find it myself annoying, but you know, I just currently because that camera just is great and it just doesn't do vlogging as well. So the quality isn't as good as my phone. So I'm going back and forth to that one. So yeah. <laughs> Bessie's using me lots of clothes and her and her dog. Oh, my dog and her dog. I like Bessie, so. Because Joy's having so much fun. Yeah. Try these. So they're granola bites, but they're gluten free on the side. And they're like mini mini cookies. Like oatmeal cookies or something. I don't know. Are you speaking English? Mm. So you told her. So you told her what happened. Just got back. I'm exhausted. Like. Like, I think it is like taking, like, sorry, my like, bone period just took like a complete toll. So, yeah, that's kind of what's going on. But, um, we just got home and I'm just trying to, like, tidy up my room, put it, pack every, put everything back where it's meant to go because I just want to be able to, like, today is kind of nice because I can just relax the rest of the night and I don't have to worry about anything else. Like, I don't have to take a shower, like that. So, so convenient but i don't really know how people take night showers i know it seems gross but i take morning showers because i'm like how like how do you get woken up in the morning like for me i also have really awful what's the word drainage problems like so if i don't want to take a shower i don't get all this stuff out of my nose and like just i feel horrible the rest of the day so i don't understand how people do it because generally like i don't know why but like it helps so much to take a shower also props to past jenna because my room is not a mess it's only a mess now because i just brought my stuff in but i love i love jenna <laughs> I'm just, I'm, i thought that was just her and just knocked it over because i'm a suitcase okay well let's do this thing change the plans change plans i guess we're going somewhere i guess we're going to eat i don't know anyway so well, i'm like when i'm cleaning out the car i need to like get this and loot it as fast as i can because even if i don't get all of it it's fine i just want to have for the most part it's all done i just because it's not like they're just not like i don't know how to explain it i just don't really have anything to wear with it Yeah. Yep. I'm scared. 
I got probably like 20 items, like for college. So exciting! I'll show you guys. Like, I'm so curious. Like the cutest stuff ever. So excited. Thank you. Bye. Two weekends, not the Mother's Day weekend, but the weekend after that. So my back camera, the uh, protective thing, um, smashed in. So I dropped it the other day, and then randomly I went to um, gently, gently wipe it with my sleeve, and um puffed it in because i was so gentle and it just i guess is super sensitive or whatever but i have some really interesting some really funny stuff happened today but a lot of god stories but i'm going to leave that to god to tell because i don't want to say anything because god says like to keep stuff that you do private if that makes sense like keep um good deeds you do behind closed doors because again i want i don't want to be like oh my goodness look at what god did through me like no look at what god did period not me like god just used me i'm just a witness like you know so anyway i want to show you guys though because we want to show you right? 45 dollars for everything i want to show you every single thing so let's just get right into this so i can't remember where we went but i know we really don't don't go thrifting like we normally don't get clothes new clothes at all so we had a little extra money so we went and we got some clothes i'm so excited because i did not go crazy or anything um i just got like a couple pieces of clothing i'm so excited though but i want to show you guys for 45 dollars keep in mind this is probably like 10 15 20 items so like i don't know how much actually but not all of these are for me like there's some movies like that so i'm just gonna i'm gonna show you guys all so here's the first bag i'm just gonna dump it out so you guys don't hear the bag like moving because i think it's so annoying okay so i got a swim top because i actually my bottoms or my top is like too small for me so i'm gonna wash this because we're going on another week trip or not week trip we're going on another trip which i could probably wear some of my clothes i'm so excited but we're going on another trip this weekend so for like a work trip but this is so cute because it's very flowy and there's two materials so like there's there's this little like material underneath which is so much better than mine because currently like my material is great and everything but like it's too small on the top area so this one's perfect then we have these sweatpants which are literally so comfortable and i'm pretty sure so they were like um six dollars for these sweatpants like i think this is probably the best one we've gone to which i'm gonna start coming to this one because i feel like they have so many options and i think because not as many people go to it it was like very chill that day and i think because maybe it was like um wednesdays are the best days to go. i do not remember i'm so sorry i'm not trying to gatekeep anything i'll let you guys know if I find out what store it was i can't remember i think it was like savers or something i can't remember but it was like a smaller store but had a lot of clothes so i really really recommend going to that place if i can try to put it in somewhere because i went on a day that apparently wednesdays weren't aren't very busy because i don't know if people are with, busy i don't know but i went and me and my mom went like there were so many options like so many cute things so many vintage like items that are like literally adorable for like the cottage core like my kind of like aesthetic and style <laughs> so excited because 
I've been trying to also do like more elegant style like I've been trying to style my clothes more and like not just being the basic white girl with like every single outfit no I'm not saying anything's wrong with being a basic white girl because I like there's times where I just jeans but I feel like any if anybody wants to know the best way to style an outfit jewelry and like a belt because I have a black belt that like it looks really good with most of my outfits because it ties it in together especially if there's like black on the shirt or the shirt's black and I have blue jeans or whatever it just depends but I think it really ties everything together depending but these are so adorable I tried them on they're so cute and then I bought this so there's like it's so comfy and perfect I think I'm gonna stretch them out just a tiny bit on this because they're like perfect length they just need to be a tiny bit longer because they're so close to being perfect so and this is so this one's so like it's um it's not like too form fitted but it's like just enough where I think it's gonna be perfect because it's very modest but like you know a little form fitted so it's easier to dress up if I want to or dress down either way there's just more clothes but then we got this this one's so adorable you guys this one is so cute it's like this white it's definitely see-through but i was thinking about wearing like a white top and it's so cute it's a little flowier but i think it's perfect like it's not too flowy but it's a little flowy on the sleeve so it's more comfy and it'll be perfect for church because i have i tried it on with two different skirts i've got a new skirt black but this was so cute with both so i'm excited to try these out Rubble dress is kind of like a moss green but it was so pretty on me and again it's kind of like all the same style kind of like beautiful dress and it looks short it's a tiny bit short but not very much like it's just not as long as i'm used to it's like i'm used to like long 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 dresses it's not like long or it's not too short but it's like a really pretty sundress so it's super cute it's honestly great for like the fall season because i could style it with like a, some find some kind of like maybe do some black long sleeves and then some leggings or something underneath or whatever like i can pair this with kind of anything and it'd be super cute so it's perfect for both seasons but i literally just love it it's so adorable and it looks so pretty and it was like looks really big but it's so cute i saw this i was like oh my god it's so cute because it's very like floral like you could say like, there's a little flowers on it it's so cute and it's like very like summery like if you especially the way i would wear it, it would be so cute it would be a good beach cover up or just like it would be perfect because it's so modest and so adorable which is perfect so adorable let me show you guys on i'm not gonna show you anything else on but because this is like something you can just like put it on over like it's so adorable you guys Okay, so it's like this little cardigan which i could either zip up wear as a shirt and like put black tank top underneath or like and it like has a little thing it's like meant for tying on bottom but it's so cute so i can be wear it as a cardigan wear it over a, well i can really wear it as a cardigan cardigan i could wear it over a dress over a tank top like there are so many different ways i can pair this because i actually have a black dress that this would be perfect with because i just tie it it's like the exact thing i was going for because it kind of like dresses like it's such a cute color that i think that it couldn't really go and i can honestly wear a tank top under it and wear it as a shirt so it's just so cute and like so adorable there's also buttons on it so i can wear it just like a shirt with like a tank top under because it's a little low but so cute and then there's this tank top which it looks a little funny but it definitely reminds me a little like Gilmore, and it's so cute like i felt so confident in it and it's just like really cute but it looks like it would be see-through but it's actually not because there's like a layer in it that's like um you can't really tell yeah you can't really see through but it's so adorable and we got this so cute skirt and it a lot of this stuff reminds me of Lorelai Gilmore and Rory Gilmore, but it's like this, you can't really see there's like layers in it, like this like little um thing, it's definitely a little tiny bit of an awkward leg, but length, but it's so cute, and it's perfect with like a lot of sew over it, I think the brown top would be so cute with this. On my phone, so, the, I'm gonna show you, so I got The Death of High Tide and An Island Sisters Mystery by Hannah Fen Den Denison. That's right, but I've heard, oh my goodness, US dollars, $26.99, but you guys, I got this for $2.80 or $98, like $2.98, what? That's such a good deal, so basically $3, but like, such a good deal, and my dad, again, looks through it, there's something in it, so I'm really, really excited to read that one, because I think it's a little bit of romance, I'm not really quite sure, but I'm so excited to read this, it's gonna be so good, because I've been wanting to read a book, so I'm gonna start this one probably later, or something today, but, and then I got books, so, I will say, one of these, so, I got Pride and Prejudice, because I literally love this one, it's so clean, and it's just so good, like, literally, I could reread this one, or rewatch this one, so many times, it's such, what, like, one of my favorites, I personally love this series, I've watched Pride and Prejudice, the series, and the movie, I've watched both, so, like, the, the series, where it's, sorry, it's not really series, it's kind of like, um, movies, like, it's just a bunch of movies that collide into a series kind of thing, I don't know if you call it a series, I don't know, but I love Pride and Prejudice so much, I actually have been wanting to read it, but I don't know, because I was reading Anne of Green Gables, 
and I don't think they're the same author, but I could not get through Anne of Green Gables. I've yet to get through it. Like, I literally just can't because I don't know if, what it is. I don't know if it's just so slow. I don't know. But I'm curious, like, how many books of Anne of Green Gables there is and how long it drags out because I'm just, like, ugh. If, I, if it's, like, what I have to go through in this series, I can't do it. And it probably be worse as a book, so it's, like, as, ugh, I can't. I don't know. I haven't continued to read it because I just can't find my story motivation, but came in. But I got this movie, and then I got How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days, which, yes, there is some stuff in it, but my family can easily skip it because they know the scenes, and normally I wouldn't want to, but, like, this is, like, a classic and one of my favorites, so we got, like, literally everybody in my family loved it, my brother, my dad, me, and my mom, so, like, once in a while we could rewatch this or something. It's just so much fun. I love it. I've been wanting to watch this because I haven't actually watched this before. Maybe I have when I was young. I can't remember, but I've been wanting to watch it with my mother. So we got these. I think just like from the thrift stores, you can find so many things. Like today was like a whole deal because a lot of the reason it was so cheap was because green tags, which a lot of my clothes were green tags, um, that were like this was like four dollars. Which normally at a store this would be like either ten, fifteen, like I can range. And that's why I'm like, guys, just thrift because a lot of these clothes look brand new, like brand spanking new that somebody didn't want or they didn't fit anymore. I'm like, just you just have to go to different thrift stores and find. Like this one was a Christian type, um, thrift store, which I. It made me so happy because it's so much easier to listen or like to be there when like you hear Christian music in the background. Me and we're just like singing to like a lot of the songs. It was so much fun. So I'm so excited. I'm gonna go wash some of these clothes, but I'm so excited. And then I'm gonna put these movies upstairs, but I'm so excited because now I can watch like if I somehow get like a DVD or me, I can watch some of these if I want if I want to rewatch them, especially like Pride and Prejudice. But I want to get like a lot. Of, me and I want to get the classics like Gilma Girls and get a bunch of stuff because I do love Gilma Girls, but. I would like to watch it with like a thing, but I'm so excited. Wow. It's <laughs> Thank like you. Car, John. It's, it's almost like your own car. So much for watching this video. Make sure you guys do a big thumbs up, subscribe, like, and turn on all notifications for my newest videos. And I cannot wait to see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you thought about it down below. And I hope to see you guys and other ones. And do let me know what you guys want to see next. If you want more book videos, if you like my vlogs, and if there's anything that you would like me to do, just let me know. And I will see you guys next time. You are so loved. And I think one of the things that really helped me to remember that was to do that every single day. And that's one thing that I really recommend you guys do. So that's my little tip for you guys, but just remember that God loves you so much, and I hope you have a great day. Peace out. Bye.